I'm going to show you how to do the mission Dirty Ice in Stealth. So the first thing that you're going to need to do is get a QR code, which you can sneak through these back doors here and get one, or you can go through this back alley. I'm going to wait for this guard to go that way because he also has a blue key card. And might as well take that and also get the QR code that's in this back alley. So we just need to wait for him. And as soon as he turns around, we can start picking this lock. Grab his blue key card. And search this phone. That will give us access to this door. And then there's a guard that comes through here, so you have to be careful of that. You're not allowed in here. We're just gonna mask up right now because we need to in a second anyways. So let's try to hide his body for now. Check out the VIP area. The display case is right over there? the most valuable merchandise. Oops. Sorry, buddy. Must have hit some button by accident. It's all so tiny. Don't they make these things for grown-ups anymore? Right, right, that sounds great. Dear Lord, they have done Let's tie up this lady too. We're gonna need an employee later back here anyways. Sure, back here. Let's move this body back here, too. Now there's a QR code on this phone that's going to let us get access to the VIP showroom. This computer also has a bunch of hints on it. So this one says that you need the manager in order to unlock the workshop and the manager leaves after a little bit so you have to be kind of fast about this for the vault door to unlock you need two people which is why i took this person as a hostage and then also it says that the basement code is the id number of the employee of the month so we're going to use all those hints if you're on higher difficulty, you won't be able to take out these cameras, but you just crouch under it. So the manager's always next to this pillar right here, at least in my playthroughs. So we're going to need to find a way to get her without alerting people. So there's a guard over there. Let's see if we can get him. First. Let's wait for an opening and try to get this manager. Take her as a human shield and very quickly go back here. Kind of difficult. Let's push her into this for the biometric scanner. And that's open. Let's put her with all the other hostages too. Okay. Now we have access to this. I'm gonna take out this camera. Again, you can't do that on a higher difficulty. You have to actually wait for it to not be looking at you. You're going to use this to sort through all the bags before you're going to load them up. So 
but now let's but now let's get to working on getting the bags first thing we need is the employee of the month code 7351 is what I got so that's going to let us access the basement down here We just need to get in this corner room over here. Wait for this guy to move. Once he starts moving, let's lockpick this. Pick him out if you have to. Yeah, everything's fine here. Great, actually. What did you think? Some clowns were trying to rob the place or something. <laughs> Move okay, this body. Right. Uh, I think that sounds good. Also, use these to distract them if you need to. This body in here, and we need this key card for the vault. Turn this off. This is going to let us get the bags without um, triggering alarms. Inside the safe, there's some evidence. And then at this point, we want to go back into the VIP showroom from the basement. Wait for this guard to move. Now we can come in here. We can use this to call. Now we can come into the showroom and start our looting. So inside of these, you're gonna get bags. Also, you can loot the vault now. Let's use one of these employees to loot the vault. It's the manager to do it. So take them as a human shield and shove them into the button. And while they're pressing the button, we can use this, and that'll open the wall. Let's make sure to keep them tied up for now, though. Bolts open. Since we disabled the power in the basement and these lasers aren't going to be on, and we can take all of this. The van is parked in the back alley. Get the bags there. I'm not exactly sure how to get the AI to actually follow me back here when I'm in stealth, so we're going to have to do all of this by ourselves, fortunately. this route because it's pretty easy. We had to kill him too. So 
open this person up to make it easier to. Now my crew should follow me back, hopefully. Remember when you get your bags to take them back here and throw them on this thing. It's going to make you get more money. Once they're scanned, you can take them back to the car. Some instructions on it, too. Let's see if we can do more than one at a time. You can do more than one at a time. Make sure to remember this, unlike me. You can grab all this stuff too. And once you're done, you can pick up the clean jewelry. So it probably can only do one at a time, actually. And you're just going to take this back to the van like normal. Probably the best way to do this is to throw all the bags in and then just take them back to the van. And in between runs, they'll be clean. point I'm gonna get a little greedy and see if we can get all the treasure in here too. Got to get the bags in the main area, but I'll run you through how I cleaned up all the civilians and random guards in that, and then show you how to get them after you do that. After you do that, you can shoot the display cases that have it with the silence gun. Someone does notice you and just take them hostage. Just going to grab all four of them that are back there. And just grab them from out there in the displays and take them here to process. There, here. Put a ton of them in this one last time and they got like stuck in there for some reason, so I'm not going to throw like a lot of them in this time. over here you can throw them to your people too if you want some help these people noticed us so let's just move them really quick Exactly. 
I think that there are 12 bags total, meaning that there should be one more, including the one that's in the scanner right now. Was that what said? So I guess there are a couple more over here. I alerted them at the end, but still got all the bags. That's it. 